fine, good day. My name is Jürgen Steinmetz from eTurbo News, and this is a breaking news update. For more news updates and shows, please go to youtube.com slash travel news group, youtube.com slash travel news group. Here's our update. New COVID-19 Omicron strain is in UK, Belgium, Germany, Netherlands and Czech Republic now. All 27 EU member states agreed to temporarily halt air travel from seven southern African nations. The UK, US and Canada have also imposed similar restrictions. United Kingdom has registered its first two cases of the new Omicron variant of COVID-19 a day after the first case of the strain, which scientists suspect could be much more contagious, was recorded in Europe. Today, a spokesperson for the Czech Ministry of Health announced that a woman returning from vacation in Egypt had tested positive for what is believed to be the novel variant of COVID-19. He added that the sample is being studied further, with official confirmation expected by Sunday morning. Belgian and German authorities are also officially confirming Omicron's advent on the European continent. Coinciding with that report from the Czech Republic, Kai Kloza, the Social Affairs and Integration Minister in Germany's Hesse region, tweeted that the Omicron variant has, with a very high degree of likelihood, already arrived in Germany. Kloza revealed that multiple mutations typical of Omicron were found in a person coming from South Africa, on Friday night. The individual was placed in quarantine pending the complete sequencing of the virus found in their sample. Authorities in the Netherlands were facing a large number of suspected Omicron cases on Friday, when 61 people arriving in Amsterdam from South Africa tested positive for COVID-19. The travelers were taken from the airport to a nearby hotel and isolated there. The Dutch Health Ministry said samples are being studied as quickly as possible to see whether they are the new variant of concern, now named Omicron. Earlier that day, the Dutch government banned all air travel from South Africa where the new strain was first detected. Passengers on the last two flights coming in from there had to spend hours on the runway, waiting to be tested. Belgium has the dubious distinction of being the first nation in Europe to have officially confirmed a case of Omicron. The country's health minister, Frank Vandenbroek, announced on Thursday that the infected patient is an unvaccinated person who tested positive for COVID-19 on November 22. According to Belgium's chief virologist, Mark van Ranst, the holiday maker had earlier returned from Egypt. Yesterday, the European Centre for Disease Prevention and Control, ECDC, warned there was still considerable uncertainty related to the transmissibility, vaccine effectiveness, risk for reinfections and other properties of the Omicron variant. The EU health authorities classed the strain as a high to very high risk. That same day, all 27 EU member states agreed to temporarily halt air travel from seven southern African nations. The UK, US and Canada have also imposed similar restrictions. Thank you for listening to our news update. There's more on youtube.com slash travel news group. Or you can read us, of course, in going to our news portal at etrobonews.com or travelnews.com. Dot online.